so you're watching part two of the behind the scenes and like always i hope you enjoy it and if you didn't watch part one well what the fuck are you doing here then go watch part one you know this video gonna be a little bit better though you ask why well because it will have voiceover oh yes voiceover you take some shit you put some voiceovers on it and boom it's gold i don't know if i did everything i think i did everything i'm here for like three hours or something i'm fucking tired don't wanna fucking eat yeah it was a pretty bad idea not taking any food next time i will take some food uh, there's Mosquitoes all over the place, so I'm like moving around that they wouldn't bite me. There was a lot of fucking mosquitoes. Like, this is me, right? And this is the mosquitoes. And the fucking mosquitoes are eating me alive. Uh, so, yeah, I think I did. <clears throat> I think I did everything. I need to go to the. Like, there's like a dark place. Like a building, a cave, or a, how the hell do you call it? Uh, I need to burn a piece of paper there. I'm gonna pack everything up, yeah? And yes, 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 yes. So to make this a little bit more interesting, I'll just tell you what happened next. So basically, I was just riding with my bike. See, I'm riding my bike. I have my tripod in my left hand. I'm riding the bike and boom, I'm still riding on the bike, but I'm a little bit more further away. And now, boom, I'm still riding on my bike. And I finally found a place I was searching for, so that's great. And now I'm gonna say, so I'll leave my bike over here. Please stand bike, please. No, no, Sta no, uh, okay. no, no. Fuck, fuck off. So yeah, there's a lot of broken glass here, so... Warning, the stunt you're about to see is performed by a trained professional. Do not attempt to regret it. Um... Yes. Hello? Yeah. Anybody home? No, fuck off. Hello? The fuck you want? Get the fuck out of my room, I'm playing I hope no one's here. I left my fishy thing from the last time I've been here. I was checking the place if it's safe and everything. Okay, so I need to burn the piece of paper and that's it. I can go home. That should be easy. I need to make this paper very cinematic. There we go. Uh, not, not cinematic enough. What about now? Oh, now that's cinematic, right? Where do we put this? Over here? Or over there? I have no idea. Looks kind of cool, right? Maybe it needs more, more dirt and stuff. So now we need to get the lighter fluid. Yeah, there it is. Yep. We'll try to open this with one hand, probably that's impossible. It is possible. This don't want to put too much, you know. Don't want to put too much lighter fluid because it might burn a lot. Sometimes your tripod is too like tall, so you know you need to improvise with bricks and shit. So I'll use this bricks instead. There we go. Now if you put it like that, see that looks much better. I mean that's too tall. Maybe like this. Sounds decent. I want something like this. But how do I accomplish that? I need to get this thing, put it under the camera, and boom! Maybe a little bit lower, even. And we need to get something else. Uh, get this one idea. Just carefully put this. And like there we go. Shit. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh. Oh. Okay, now I need to oh, set this thing on fire and and that's it. So I'm gonna light this thing up, run back really fast, and then slowly come back. Uh, I hope this works the first try. Oh. Oh, oh. oh fuck. Okay, it's burning and in. Oh, oh, okay. Go, oh, oh. go. Now we're slowly walking to the paper while this thing is burning. I hope my feet doesn't set on fire. 
everything is made from concrete, so it shouldn't burn anything. How to extinguish fire? Tips by Zeber. Throw a big fucking rock. What time is it? It is uh, 18.21. 21. Okay, so I'll take all my shit, I'll get on my bike, put everything back, and I'm gonna go home and eat something because I'm starving. Okay. My batterino, didarino, batterino, pidarino, good, good batterino. My battery died basically. Yeah. Okay, so I packed everything up, and now I'm gonna go home and maybe gonna find something on the back home. What the fuck? No, that is not how English works. Okay, so I packed up my shit. Uh, I'm gonna start heading home now. And. Maybe I'll record something on the way. Yes. That is proper English. Very good. To the home we go. If you're driving on your bike and you want to stabilize your footage, just hide, just hold the camera really tight to your stomach and the, the, sh the shot will be very stable. How you see? It is very stable. Very stable shot. And now you can go over all over the place. Very stable. Oh my god, okay, this is not stable, okay. So I came back home. I didn't record anything on the way because I was real tired. Doggy, dog, dog, dog. Good dog, good, good, very good dog. So I did 13 kilometers without stopping, so yeah. I gonna go edit video. Yay. Oh, fuck. I am back home. Very nice. Oh. Now I can start editing my video. Very good. So originally I was planning to end the video right at this point, but it felt kinda short. So I decided that I'll put some footage from part 3, because probably the next part will take me even longer to make. So have... Oh shit. So yeah, have this very nice spooky cave exploration. Now that's how you make a professional voiceover. This place is actually terrifying. <laughs> But I like this place, it's good. Yeah, first I'm gonna show you the the entire thing there. So let's get the flashlight and... And there we go, there it is. Okay, there we go. I set the shutter speed on 50, I lowered the frame rate to 24 and I made the ISO automatic. So now it should be, yeah, it's brighter, okay. So now we're gonna go explore this place. You know, I've been here already, but it's pretty cool. There's number two on the wall over there. There's bricks all over the place, though. You can break your legs here. There's ventilations there and stuff. I hope no one's here. It's kind of quiet. I think no one's here. So, yeah, we got planks. There's a stop thing here. Yeah, you need to be careful on these though, you can like, you know, cut your artery or something. You don't want to do that, because you might bleed out and die. Oh shit. Yeah, there's a lot of bricks here. And holes that you can twist your legs. So yeah, don't twist your legs. Yeah, I like this place. This was like, maybe a... Maybe, because that place is like a repair station. So maybe at this place, the workers were like, Sleeping and shit, I don't know. There's rooms over there. There's some old Ventilation that broke down. There are some electricity things here So maybe back in the days, you know, there was l light here yeah. Oh green walls. I like these. Anything else? There's like stop. This wasn't here before though. Yeah, these, these weren't here before, so, so someone put them here. Because, you know, they're probably trying to tell people that don't go here because you're gonna fucking die. And this place is probably like falling in or something, so I'll not go here. Don't go here because it is not safe. Do not go here. Cans. Oh, that's it, I think. Yeah, that's it. Blue walls. And there's an exit over there. Hello? 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 And more stop line things. 
Yeah, you can't really go anywhere here because there's plants all over the place. So we're gonna go back now and I'm gonna record the bucket scene because my camera is actually on 60% now and this is my last battery. So if this battery dies, I can't record anything. So it is a pretty nice place, you know. I might use this place in the future to record something. I think these are like bathrooms, right? Yeah, they are bathrooms, look. See? Yeah. An old, really old bathroom. Oh yeah, yeah it's walking here, it's, it's terrible. Let's run back and let's record the glowing bucket. I need to connect the battery though. To the... Ah, shit. There's dead animals. Ah, okay, can I show this? Can I show this on YouTube? Is this legal? <laughs> what is that shit? Yeah, that is shit. Someone, someone fucking shit here. Hello, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and